Okay, my turn. No more mine. No. No more No. <laughs> my turn. No, it's my turn too. No. What about me? Do you want to share your experience? <laughs> it hurts so bad. Uh, <laughs> What do you think about this, Taurino? Uh, <laughs> huh? Uh, he wants to do it. Oh. oh, it hurts so bad. I'm not even kidding. It hurts so bad. Oh. Aquí 100 dólares la hora porque Gusti venía que le den una tallada. ¿Dónde es donde está? Right. Yeah. Oh. 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 Con las dos manos, eso sí. Oh, yeah, thanks for the así. massage. Así. What a great masseuse I have. Pura so madre. Uh, yeah, he's not. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm just gonna start the intro here because um, I've been vlogging, kind of, and I haven't done an intro. So I'm pretty sure I wore the same sweater in my last video. Sorry, not sorry, I really like it. Got it on Amazon. It's Hanes, it's a men's sweatshirt, crew neck. My boyfriend's here. I'm so happy. Come say hi. Come say hi right now. <sighs> mm. Show them. Show them what you're doing. Get close. Get really close so they can see you. Baby, like, get down. He has the RR mask that I used in my last video um, on right now because his skin is literally coming off. Literally coming off onto my sweatshirt. Literally. Like dandruff. Literally. And it's gross. Literally. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay. And I'm also going to get ready with my sister so I can review the KKW Tim's Mario collection for you. Is this lopsided or is it just me? You got a problem with that? We look too bright. Oh, actually, yeah, no, we don't. Let me get out of the chair. Can you scooch over a bit? Uh -huh. So, guys, today's Sunday. And I was feeling very unproductive, so I said, you know what? Let me do something with my life. Let me get ready, take some new Instagram pics, try on my stuff from Shein and Boohoo because I received it already. And I thought, if I don't do this now, I'm never going to do it. Something to my, come on, get on camera. You've Hi never. Hi, guys. Just be yourself. Okay. Spear yourself. What the fuck do you want me to say? No, you're getting ready. Well, I'm getting ready to go to um, my husband and my dad's friend's 50th birthday party. Mm -hmm. And I was gonna go to that. She was gonna go, but she got too lazy. She said she's like, I'd rather stay home and film. Yeah, because no one's gonna be guys. home. So. She's very committed right now. Yeah, I love what I do. And um, you guys can't see this ugly acne I have on my cheek right now, thank God. The softening tool in this camera is like one of my favorite things. So when I get a new camera, you guys will see my real skin all the time. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, I'm gonna review the KKW stuff for you, but let me just Excuse do me. my base first and fuck you no holes. Or with these sticks. I know, I've been contouring first and then putting my foundation. No, I saw you do that, so I'm gonna do it too. Yeah. Two. <laughs> this is really dark. I think I got this to contour. <laughs> That's orange. I know. <laughs> Thanks, babe. <laughs> yeah, this is more like my color. You got that from when we, like, when we were like, it's for contour number 10. Yeah, I put a contour shade on my face. Oh, you know. I think he did fall asleep. Baby, can you watch this? Oh, you want to go play? Yeah. Text him. Yeah. You're going to ditch me? What? Oh, calm Dude, down. I can't believe this. Kim? You're going to ditch me. What is this? How does your skin feel? I am. How does skin tell everyone her skin? Oh my skin looks great and feels great. Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> Can you put it have on and stuff like wash it? Please. Can you also bring the chapstick pretty please? Because my lips are very dry. <laughs> I know this is exactly <laughs> sorry. Did you take my sponge? Yeah. For what? To go wash it. What? I'm gonna use it for my face. <gasps> this is literally orange. What am I gonna do? There. I literally turned on the bright. No, this is like really orange. Look how orange this is. I don't. I don't know really what I'm gonna do. <sighs> I need to figure it out. The fuck do I do, dude? I'm, in. I'm just gonna wear a turtleneck today. It's okay if I go out with an orange face. A lot of people do that, you know, like those like Instagram baddies you see. They wear turtlenecks. Yeah, because sometimes their foundation is so mesh. Yeah, my foundation's not matching right now, you guys, so don't judge me. Like, do you see this? This is literally orange. Little it's top fun. secret for you guys. Wow. Where did you see that? You never seen that on other people's YouTube videos? Mm -mm. 
all I know what I'm doing, I'm gonna brighten it with hella concealer. This is like white ass concealer from, <gasps> um, what's it called? Color Pop. Mm -hmm. This could turn into a mess, you guys. I'm not a makeup um, person anymore, so I'm just kidding, yes I am. It was actually kind of work. I'm gonna be telling you guys what products I'm using because honestly, it's really fucking annoying to have to do that. And this is not a makeup related video. Well, you're doing the review, aren't you? Yeah, so I'm just gonna tell them like what products I'm using from the collection. Thanks. Uh -huh. So here I have the very graceful blush. The number, I mean, the first blush was called Graceful. This was very graceful and it's beautiful. Peachy, Wait, then what? No, then the first collection didn't have a blush. It was like when she launched blushes, that's Grace. Well, we have one called Graceful. Yeah, I bought it. Grace or something, but it's but not from like your pinky dip. Oh, one. my bad. Let's see this gorgeous color. Oh, my lord. I feel like Kim Kardashian already. <laughs> Dude, do you see this? Kim Kardashian? Not Kim Kardashian. No, Kim Kardashian? No, not Kim Kardashian. Do you hear that? My boyfriend's so in love with me. I feel like a doll. Literally, like I feel like I'm fake, and I like to feel like that. This is so fucking. Look at this. It looks look like at the princess. Like I look so fucking cute. I don't like looking at like plastic, but you're not born in my mouth. <laughs> contour is the City Bronzer by Maybelline. Just gonna put that in here so you guys can go get it. Very inexpensive, very good. It's a number two hundred, and I just keep it in the back, right up here, to make me look Wait, like a no. model. But I'm not. <laughs> If you guys can hear my dad and mom in the background, yeah. they're having a normal conversation, okay? But they're literally yelling because they can't hear because my mom's literally drying her hair. So I've been putting blush on my cheeks just right here instead of like all over the cheek, like all back here and stuff because when you smile, that's where you see it. And it's so freaking cute. Okay, let's start the review. So the blush was bomb right off the bat. Beautiful color. When I saw it, I honestly thought it was going to be too dark, but it's really pretty. What else did we get, Daisy? The eyeshadow? Got everything. Got everything. So I'm gonna try the eyeshadow palette. Her eyeshadow formulas um, aren't that well, like good. Honestly, I don't like them that much. I'm not gonna lie. What? I like. Them. I don't like them that much. But there's so many paparazzi. This beautiful nudes. Like this looks really yellow on camera, but I promise you it's not. These two nudes I'm gonna be using because they look so pretty. Okay. I'm gonna start with the so many paparazzi on this dirty brush, so I really know what the color looks like. Honestly, I should have started. I just used that brush for that color. Oh, so. okay, cool. Or it was this one, actually. I should have started with the cleaner brush. Okay. Oh, wow. I don't think it's picking up on camera. No, it is. Look at that. Do you see the difference? That is nice. That's a, that's a really... You know, I will buy this eyeshadow palette just for this color again. Like, if I hit pan, I'll let it again. She needs to do singles. This is a beautiful color. This is the perfect nude. Well, what am I expecting, you know? She's the queen of nudes. I know. Literally. She knows, she of is. all nudes. Yep. Oh, she's funny. I feel like I know her, you know? I feel like I'm turning into her right now. Okay. Because she's turning <laughs> on her I know. I know, you guys. Okay, and then Don't Move is the bottom one that I showed you. I'm gonna do that one too, because that one is so nice. More Spanish lately. Por si no se dieron cuenta. Me llamo Melissa García Ochoa, vivo aquí en California con mis papás y mis um, hermanos. Mi novio vive en México. Recientemente ha llegado aquí a visitarme, right? right. Um, <laughs> y este video se va a tratar de lo que vamos a hacer hoy. Es un domingo y vamos a ir a una fiesta, pero ya no vamos a ir. Mi novio me va a cocinar porque no sabe cocinar mucho. Solo voy, le hice uh -huh. como un challenge. You don't remember to do the heat Exposing! Set. Yeah, he doesn't know how to cook a lot. <laughs> so, um, también vamos a, me voy a tomar fotos para subir a mi Instagram con diferentes outfits ahorita que tengo tiempo. Quiero que sea tarea, que más. Oh, voy a probarme la ropa que ordené de Shein and Boohoo.com para que vean los sizes y la calidad y todo. There you go. Ahora sí, me creo. Wow, so proud of you, Moza. Mi español um, ha mejor, mejorado muchísimo por tener un novio que es mexicano también. Right, baby? Yeah. No me has dicho, te puedo enseñar a hablar francés también. Oh, really? Yeah. Mi amor, habla algo bonito. No, ahorita no. Do that to me once again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, my sister, you guys, my sister is the most gullible 
Right, Izzy? Yeah, kind of. You are very extremely global. Mm -hmm. So, oh, I'm also adding Glam King. This is beautiful. Honestly, this palette is all worth it. Like, these taupe colors are so pretty. My sister put me on to this Pure Radiance by Bare Minerals. I thought she was just like hyping it up because sometimes we don't have like the same taste in makeup. But this, it's you don't even, the bomb. Yeah, you don't even need to put highlighter. Doesn't it just give you like a perfect, like, he it's like healthy glow? Like, if you want to look like your skin is so healthy and it looks like shit like mine does right now, it'll make it look like that. Like, I'm not kidding. And a photograph so pretty in the sun, it looks so natural. It doesn't look like an overwhelming highlight. I, love I mean, it. I have when to put you don't want day. that, you know? I do my makeup now. Yeah. When you don't want an overwhelming highlight, it's very good for that. Okay, so lashes on, eyebrows did. Last thing, what is it? I'm gonna do is try the lip stuff. It's not at all like a nude too, I'm not kidding. When you swatch it, it really looks like it, huh? Where no, it? no, it doesn't look like it but at all. But this is way lighter. It's a caramel -y. Yeah. I'll be purchasing one for myself. Okay, where's the lipstick, honey? You know, you really do need to look at personal assistant because you just want everything handed to your hands. But what's because I don't see it. Oh, look looking, Maza. Oh, there we go. You just took off the lid, you didn't even get the lipstick. Yeah. Okay, so the lipstick is called, um, he's a mixer, like Kim would say, because Mario mixes so many different colors. <laughs> I don't know if I like this. Why? I know. It's gonna last like fucking five seconds. Lip gloss, oh no, this is actually, literally guys, Kim Kardashian who? She's right here, just kidding. Is it like the Patrick Star video that you made? <gasps> yeah. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Literally took my breath away. Haven't even dipped it back in. Are you looking at this? You gotta have the personality to wear this lip gloss, okay? Because if you don't feel like a Kim Kardashian, you're not gonna look like Kim Kardashian. And the whole point is to look like her, right? You don't even take a plastic surgery after this collection. Exactly. I like her. <gasps> Lip injection too. Like I needed some before putting this on, but now, papi. Uh, so, like, these are I don't need it anymore because oh, look at this lipstick. Oh, ya no los copa, no? pa. Oh, it's good. Nice, right? Pero no me salto. He's a lucky man. Yeah, lucky man. Lucky man. Lucky man. Lucky man. So he said, yeah, I was like, can you take a look? Because I'm already a skinny ass bitch and my like jawline is so defined, I'm not gonna define it even more because I don't want to scare people thinking it's fake, you know? So I'm just gonna like, bronze. She it actually has head. a really like nice jaw and I was the non-gifted one in this family. So this is gonna be the try on haul portion of this video, and I'm gonna start with Boohoo. So this is the first set that I got from Boohoo. Let me just, you know, me I will link everything down below for you guys to see. Um some of the items are sold out and I'll tell you why, okay? But it's very tragic, but this item isn't sold out. I got this in a medium. I feel like it's black so you can't really see But it has this little tie you can take off. I got this in a medium because I wanted to want it to be like comfortable baggy But honestly, I could have gone a large like I really like these kind of items to be like Really baggy and really cozy and I feel like the crotch area you can't really see but it's too like short because my waist is up here and if I put this like lower um, You can see like all of my belly and like huh not really into that right now so yeah but this is it this is a set it's knitted so it's like this it's very 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 soft it's not itchy at all and it's actually flared at the bottom hey my socks they have 100 happy <laughs> they're funny but they're flared well, that's hella cute. like you could see right here this is the first set. i'll link it down below it's obviously in black and i really like it the only thing that i'm saying is like i said the crotch area it's too short Okay, this is an axe item and I kind of shift it over because I want to show you how horrific, literally horrific, okay? I had a nervous breakdown when I put this on. I'm not kidding, like I'm not being dramatic. Um, I love how I always say I'm not being dramatic, but I'm completely dramatic. I had a nervous breakdown. Baby, come tell them, come. What are you wow. doing? Is that what you're cosas? Yeah. <gasps> my baby's cleaning my room. He's so nice. Okay. Also, he's tired of seeing your room look like that. That's why he's probably helping you. That is so rude. Okay, anyways, I was on FaceTime with him and I wasn't even paying attention to anything he was saying because I was looking online like, 
I need a new size. Like when I turned, tried this on, I immediately went on to order a small because this was so big. And I want it to be oversized. And it's already oversized. And I look like I'm uh, like so big. Like, was it really putting that in the video? Like how <laughs> Yeah, I am. Like people need to see this. It's so cute. Like so cute. The pants are so cute. It's so comfortable. It's such a good look, but it's just way too big. And they don't have it anymore. So I actually contacted Boohoo on Instagram DM, Twitter, and their Twitter DM. And they actually replied to me three times. Oh, and Instagram like comment. And they were like, oh, like we don't, we can't say when we're gonna restock or if we're gonna restock and shit like that. So they're like, just keep looking at the website, see if it gets restocked. Um, this broke, so they better still accept my fucking return. But I'm gonna be returning this because it doesn't fit. That's the point of this. This is the next item and it's exactly, well, okay, well, it appears to be exactly like the blue one. They weren't under the same name, like, but it's just this beautiful nude, so pretty. It's a whole set and it's really inexpensive for a set. It was like 40 bucks for these two. That's that. And the pants are so cute too. And they're flared. But they might need to be cut a little bit. They're kind of long. Okay, the next item are these sweatpants. Joggers, as you may call them. I'm turning around really fast because they're see-through. I'm going to be returning these two. I got them in a size 8, which I really don't know what I was thinking. Um, they fit baggy in all the wrong places and I wanted them to be baggy like a baggier look you know like kind of street style kind of cool but um that's not what this vibe is giving me but I'm really gonna try to find the other sweatpants that I absolutely like adore from Boohoo they are so thick and such good material and they just suck you in and make you look like a freaking like Kim Kardashian wannabe on Instagram you know and that's definitely what I'm trying to go for so <laughs> So I'll like try to leave them below. I got them so long ago, but if they have some, I'm definitely gonna be ordering them. And I got them in a size four, I believe. These are a size eight, and I'm usually a size like four in bottoms, four or six. Yeah, usually the six. So I don't know what I was thinking. I was like, oh, let me go size up. But they are very, very, very see-through, not good quality. Okay, now I'm gonna try on the stuff from Shein. This is actually the first set I'm gonna be showing you. Let me lower the camera so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So this is the set. It is like a ribbed sweatshirt material very stretchy very soft very comfortable thin so it's not that like warm but um very cute with like a coat i don't know what i'm going to be doing about like tucking this in because i am going to have to wear a fat hat because i look really fat for my stomach right here that's why i'm not showing you guys well okay, so i guess i'll just show you yeah i'm gonna have to wear a fat hat because this is not this is not cute so i probably will like tie this or even like scrunch it up and go like this i don't know but it's very cute it is see-through like with shein some of the things could be like lower quality than you expected but it's okay because i always wear a fat hat with this kind of stuff anyways let me show you the accessories i got from shein i got this headband i've been trying to like look more ladylike and i feel like this is really in right now when you want to look like a lady isn't this like so cute like look at this how cute it is with this sweater like i look so cute so then i got these clips and i'm not going to be putting them in because they kind of rip your hair out like they're not the best of quality but just for the trend that's another thing I have to tell you guys. I've been hopping on all these trends, right? Which we all do. But my big thing was, I would waste all this money on all these trends. Like, I probably would just get all these trendy things from Shein, so I'm not, like, wasting all my bucks. How cute are these? Yeah, Daisy, come show them. You look so pretty. Look how beautiful my sister looks. Turn. Well, I have to do my hair to finish it. No, no, turn. Look, look at her hair. Watch. Turn around. This is all her hair and it's so thick and healthy like look at this so thick like you should feel it, it feels like a fake hair i mean fake ponytail it ain't extensions girls yeah and she just got her ass done with the doctor oh, um <laughs> no i didn't show them. Gifted. thank you grandma turn around she just got her ass done with no, dr campos uh, lotus i'm just kidding no she didn't she's always had a huge ass okay Can but anyway yours and no you both love you. um let me go get the other stuff. Good, the last good. items, actually no, I forgot about this other stuff I want to try on, but let me just show you guys these shirts. I got three t-shirts, all from the men's section. I'll link the sizes down below because I didn't check. I think they're like mediums. Yeah, men's mediums. But this is cute. I don't know who this guy is. I think it's, I don't want to say like something stupid, so I don't know who it is. But the t-shirts are not that thick, but what I can say is that they are extremely, extremely soft. They're more of like this flimsy material. I don't know if you could tell. 
So they're see-through a little bit too. So you can see I have like a, a gray sports bra underneath. A little bit see-through, but for the price, I think they're bomb. This is the other t-shirt. I don't know what it says. I think it says like... Keep warm. Keep warm, which I don't really care about like shirts that say stupid stuff like that because the shirt itself is really cute. It's just this man covering his face. Kind of looks like... I don't know who, but his jewelry is cool. But yeah, they're just graphic tees and that's it. The same material as the other one. Flimsy, thin, very airy, very comfortable, very... Okay, this next one says Gallant, Gallant. I don't know what that means. If you do and it's something weird and funny, please tell me. Um, if it's gross, please don't tell me. But this is like the best purchase I've made from Shein in my life. Because surprised how soft this shirt is. Like... I don't think you could see. We know like what I wouldn't like about this shirt because it's really soft, very comfortable, and a really cute color that just goes with like a lot. Okay, this next set is literally also one of the best purchases that I've ever made from Shein ever. Okay, because this quality, like look how cute this is. You just see, this is so cute. It's cropped, they're flared. I love this kind of style right now. This is what I wore to pick up my boyfriend the other day at the airport with like a long coat and some leather like flat small dainty sneakers and he really liked it. I really like it. This color is beautiful. This is great material. It's very very thick. The only thing is that they always get like the crotches kind of wrong in the sizes. To keep up with the trends because I've been loving the small bag like shoulder trend. I got these from Shein and actually it's funny today my cousin Claudia and I were looking at misguided.com and they have really cute stuff right now, so you guys should go look. They have the same exact bag, and I don't think they have it in, in this color, but they have it in black for like $22, and I think I got it like for $13 or something on Shein, so go look at that. This is literally so cute. Look at this. Very sturdy, not too thin. It's just, you get what you pay for, you know what I mean? Like, this one's actually thicker. This one is so cute. Like, look at this. This is so cute. Very inexpensive. Keep up with the trends. Look at Shein, guys, please, because you don't want you don't want to waste your money when things are gonna go out of style. Like, and I have one more item from Shein, and I almost forgot to show you guys these half size up, but these are very true to size. I was very scared about these, but that's why I like Shein. They have like a thousand reviews on every single one of their items, so thank God for that. Always follow the reviews. Let me show you guys. They're very cute. I'm very excited. Hey guys, I know I'm like all over the place with these angles and stuff, but um, thank you guys for watching that portion of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're going to Super Burger right now because we are so hungry and my man loves burgers. I don't like burgers that much, but I like onion rings and ranch and stuff like that. So I'm probably gonna get a burger too, like not gonna lie. But I'm down, like I'm so hungry, I'm ready to go. And he just cleaned my room. Do you guys wanna see what he did? Yeah. Look what he did, he's so sweet. He folded everything for me. Come on, stop picking out your face. Are you excited to try yeah, this place? so hungry. Me too. We got a milkshake. I'm so excited. Oh, here it is. Thank you. Right on time. Yeah. We, um, it's coffee toffee. Yeah. Coffee toffee. Regular coffee. Incredible. I can't wait for my food. Um. So basic. Just kidding. <laughs> Nothing. So what? Basic because you're taking a picture of your food. That looks hella good. Look at that. Well, baby, what did you think about the place we went to? Was hella good. It was so Everything, good, right? Yeah. I love it there. I love it too. I feel literally so sick. Like that was just the last straw for my body and my stomach. I'm not kidding. Like I've been eating like crap ever since Thanksgiving. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, four days now. And my body's like, bitch, you've had enough, okay? Like it's too much, so. I literally feel nauseous. I'm not even kidding. I feel great. Because <laughs> you could eat whatever you want. Yeah, my you body's like... Sick. My body's like all you can eat, you know? <laughs> that reminds me of sushi, all you could eat. I love all you could eat sushi. You don't like all you could eat because you barely eat. I love sushi. 
<laughs> I know, but you. <laughs> but you barely eat when we go. Swish it like Mayana bien rápido, you know? It's rice, that's why. Yeah, Peru. I don't know. So we had dinner and like I said in the car, I'm feeling really, 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 really sick. So I'm just going to call it a night. My boyfriend's not going to make me dinner anymore because I thought that like, but I can't, you know, I'm just going to, I can't even eat anymore. And like, I just ate and it's, it's way too late. So he'll just make me dinner another time. And let me know what you guys enjoyed the most about this video. Like, subscribe if you haven't already. Please comment. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Thank you so much. Bye.